Ain't she a beaut, everybody? It is finally done. It is super long, and guess what? I want to say I am sorry. This took a lot longer than I was hoping it would. It took a week, and I didn't have any episodes in there planned out because I'm still trying to learn the flow of an episode so that if, you know, a big project like this comes along again, I'll at least have something to fill it with. I have to apologize there. This is kind of new to me, but I'm still, you know what, obviously I'm still learning. That being said, it is done. I have just the item placement to put in there. What we have going on here is a overflow. I decided to destroy that from going from there to there because it actually needs to go from here to over here. I, I'm not going to move that. I'm just going to grab enough hoppers to chain, daisy chain it over. With that, oh, well, hello there. With that being said, I want to show you exactly how it works. So right now, there are no items in here. If we go ahead and pull her up, and I'm going to do this only once to make sure it works. When I know it works, then I will fill in the rest of them. But let's come right, right here. Yeah. The middle one right here. Not the one at the top, not the one at the bottom, but the middle one right here. What you want to do is you want to put one two, three, four in there, and then you're going to fill uh, with, with 41. So let's cut that in half, cut that in half. No, that's fine. It'll still go down to 41. And down to 41. Excellent. So if a rotten flesh comes up my glass elevator, it'll travel along until it goes, oh, look, there's rotten flesh. Drop down. Anything else will just pass right on over. Just confirm, you'll see that there should be a couple in there, the excess. And just to make sure that it indeed works, let's go ahead and run a simulation. We're just going to go up to the top of the glass tower right here. Since I don't have any items currently going through because I haven't fixed the items to go down over. They're still going in the old one. But let's grab some rotten flesh. Let's grab, you know, let's grab all 19. We're going to throw all 19 in. As long as all 19 go in, we know that it works fine. You'll see it start firing off in, well, right now. Come over, and you know what? We're just going to wait for it to get done firing off. This shouldn't take too long. It's only 19 of them. It is done, and just like that, all 19. So what I'm going to do now is I'm going to go ahead and repeat the process and do a little bit of cleanup for each item. The items, however, are not random by the way i do have a specific order as iron and sugar are the least ones to well get dropped by the enemies i will have iron right here and sugar right here but let me go ahead and fill all the items and i'll be back when i get done with the iron portion and i will finish this chain off right here okay last one go ahead and put the iron and there we go. So we got iron, we got sugar, we got glowstone. Really wish I could run right now. We got sticks, we got a spider. We got bottles, we got arrows. We got string, we got, that's on the other side, spider eye, we got redstone, gunpowder, must be on this side, bones, and rotten flesh. So we got everything, everything is put in and all good to go. And so let's go ahead and finish this chain right here. Grab a hopper, bam, 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 put it, bam, uh, over one more. Yeah, put it over one more, over, over. Let's get a couple building blocks to go up there because I don't want it to accidentally, I don't want to accidentally mess up. So. Let's do this. 
It'll go here, here, and done. All right, so let's say I didn't want my spider heads. It should fire off. There we go. So it is all finally completed. I am extremely happy. All I have to do now is sit back and watch the drops. But unfortunately, we actually have to make it so it now drops from here. So let's go under and get that underway. Alrighty then. Let's go under. If we can get under. Actually, let's take a drink of this. Then let's go under. Or now let's go under. So what we need to do, and I even got my good pickaxe for this, is we need to complete this water channel. Now, the question is, how do I do that from the outside? Let's dig that one, then dig that one. And I'm in. Sweet, I'm in. Let's go ahead and plug that up, plug that up. And that should go right to the edge. That's exactly what I want. And I'm going to have it go to the edge just in case, because I don't want anything to get stuck. I don't think it will, but I'm also paranoid. So, I know for a fact that the water chain goes right here. So I need to put a block of ice here. So I'm going to get rid of that one. I'm going to have that one stay there. Wait a minute. Wait a minute, wait a minute. We got one, I need depth strider. We got one, we got two, three, four, five, six, and seven. No, I am sorry, I needed to kill that block right there. So let's go ahead and put this one back. Let's kill that. I need to walk for a little bit, thank you. So yeah, I almost made a boo-boo. So we need to put a half slab right there. And then we need to put a Now here's where my water boots come into play. Water boots. Water boots. There we go. Water boots. But first I need a half slab. And you know what? I don't think I can make a half slab like this. Oh, that is disappointing. All right. Got my half slabs. And plug you up. Finally. We're going to break you. And then we're going to put that half slab right there. Nope. I needed to put the half slab right there. Let's get rid of that block. Plug you up and put you down I need to grab some water there we go and the water will go right see so it doesn't go there the half slab has to go right here right but i do believe i messed up because i put a half slab oh well that actually that kind of works for the moment i will get rid of that in just a second Let's put a half slab there. No. And then let's put the water there. Excellent. And actually what I want to do is I want to kill that. And I'm going to go ahead and just go back, go around. And then let's get rid of... Let's get rid of this water. That's what I want to do. I want to get rid of the water. You can go away now. Get rid of the water. I need to get rid of all the water, unfortunately. Alright, here's where I'm at so far. I am just putting in the final block. All of this is made of ice. I have it swimming from under here. So I should now be right at the bottom. This water is actually coming from outside of the sea. So all of the drops come down through this hole. They'll hit this water stream. They'll come over here. And then I'm going to need to put another... We need another water source. So let me go ahead and just grab some water right there. Put you out. Where does it stop? 
There we go. And then another half slab. Before we put the half slab, we're going to put water there. It's going to flow that way. However, we're going to stop it coming this way by half slab. There we go. So the water should be just fine. Let's get out of here. Let's, let's take a hike. Because we are done. This was the old way to go. So I will eventually get rid of all this. But I'm not going to do it right now. I am going to make sure that the items are indeed now flowing as they should. Please let this all work. Because if it does, all is good. And this will finally be finished. After a week's work of doing just one thing. Let's plug that up. How do we test? How do we test? How do we test? Uh, first, let's take off my boots because we know what happens when I keep my boots on. So let's pillar up. Let's, what do I have that's stackable? A glass bottle. So there goes the glass bottle. Goodbye, Mr. Glass Bottle. We believe in you. Alright, it's down. So if all has worked correctly, we should be seeing the glass bottle come through and fire off. Please let it come through and fire off. That's the only thing I want right now. Um, um, let's use rotten flesh. Since I know that's the thing right there, maybe, kind of, hopefully. Well, there's some rotten flesh right there. Come on, you should fire off. That's all I'm hoping for, baby. Come on. Come on. Please, you're the last thing that needs to be worked on. And I don't see anything going. All right, so troubleshooting time. What is... So it's not there that it's being stopped. Where is it being stopped at? Uh, you know what? I am going to make all of this ice as well. Just to make sure that nothing gets stopped by any means. Let's grab you. Let's walk. Okay. So let's put my boots back on. Then let's walk this way. All of that's done. Now, where are you being stuck at? Oh, they're falling. Oh, no. All of my beautiful items. I'm almost positive that that's the reason why. But, you know what? Let's just go ahead and plug this. Walk over. Get rid of this. All of this should now be ice. So, let's count seven. One. Oops. One, two, three, four, five, six seven and then we get our half slab we need our water back let's go ahead and plug this back up and put our water source back in all right now everything should be good to go. I should actually make sure that there is indeed no more open holes. I can't believe I forgot something that silly. What's this right here? Nope, that is, it looks to be ice. It looks to be ice. All right, so that's iced over. Let's go back up and put some... I don't know. Let's just go ahead and put the rotten flesh back up in there. Or actually, we. Oh, no! That gets old after a while. Just a little bit. Oh, cool. I saved it. Awesome. So let's. 
Let's hope all the items are coming through. Nope, all of my buckets just... I have two buckets that went over the edge. All right, let me go ahead and one, two. Boots are indeed off. Fix that back up. And now we have to wait for it to come off again. But my question is, I didn't see any of the items come through. I'm gonna have to go down there and, oh, nope, there are the items. There are all of the beautiful items. That's what I was looking for. Why did it take so long, though? And why is that spider... How did that spider survive? So let's block you off. Get that. Put you there. Alright, that should be done in fine and dandy. So I see all of these items, and you know what? Just for the giggles... Let's go around and see if we got any more rotten flesh. Okay, so there's one because we took all 19 out. And I know for a fact that the other ones work. So the items items go down. They're being pushed by the water stream. And there they all are. There's a rotten flesh. Let's come over here and double check. Rotten flesh goes in. And I'm happy. That is the whole system Finally, up and working, up and running, up and done. I am extremely happy. There's nothing else more to do than to make this area look pretty and get rid of all of the, well, all of these blocks. <gasps> no, 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 you actually, you stay. See, this is why I need to put a different block there because I thought I was going to, you know what, is there a block I can use right quick? No, I'll remember to bring a block over here. But you know what? That is all the time I have for you today. My name is RLD, and this project is finally done. Except for some cleanup, which I will do. But just to let you know, on the next episode that is coming later this week, I promise, we are going to find a village, which I did see when I was searching. Which, let's see, which direction am I? There's the thing. Behind me, directly behind me, there's a mainland, and then it will be a village, and it does have villagers. I'm hoping for 10 so we can make a small iron farm, but we'll just have to see. So until then, once again, RLD, and you guys all have a fantastic day. Goodbye!